<clears throat> hey Libra. So we're gonna do a reading for y'all today. If you haven't seen my other video, my real video for Libra, go ahead and watch that before you watch this. Um I believe my videos will start to type of like glitch Loki. So just bear with me. Um this is a random reading. Keep in mind your energy could be reversed. So if you're a feminine, your energy could be more masculine. And your significant other could be um, more feminine than masculine. Or, you know, however you, your story is. Uh, take with you what resonates. Throw away what doesn't. Because it could be for somebody else. Um, this reading might not resonate at all, but it can guide you in your life. Personal readings will be in be in stock in the year of 2030 or when I have 20,000 supporters. Love y'all. Thank y'all so much. Patience makes perfect. Okay, Libra downloads is I have a sense of humor. So somebody could be saying that they have a sense of humor. Somebody could have a lot of energy. A lot of uh, playful energy today. Just go ahead and scratch this off. So yeah, Libra, you could be a uh, happy or have a lot of playful like energy. Um, the card is photograph. So if you go to my reel, it has photograph. Looking at your photos, missing you, nostalgia, make new memories. So somebody could be looking at your photos you sent them. Or you could be on their social media platform. They could be looking at your photos. Or this could be you, Libra. You could be looking at people's photos. Okay. So let's read the daily affirmation. Okay. If you hear that little bubbly noise, that's just my humidifier. Okay. Your emotions run high today. Don't let them cloud your mind and drive your actions, or it may cause irreparable damage to your friendships. Circumstances are favorable, favorable for you to take defensive steps toward improving your career. Don't depend on other people's opinions. It's high time for you to become a leader, take your life in your own hands, and steer your own course. If you are thinking, I mean, if you are looking for a relationship, you can be as bold and open as you wish now. Um, and it will pro produce only good results. Today is going to be action packed, so you might need a shift, some appointments to lift, to fit everything in. So you might have to shift over some appointments. Um, if you are looking for some type of romantic relationship, you could be as bold as you can today. So be it as be as bold as you can and open. Um, it's a good time for you to become a leader. Take life in your own hands. Don't ask for other people's opinions. Just trust your intuition. And once you have your opinion, then you could just focus on that and trust that instead of trusting everybody else's. A daily affirmation is I exhale negativity and inhale happiness. So that's a daily affirmation. It's Moon and Gemini. You could get a haircut today. You can do skincare. You can do business. And you can have a garden today or make your garden. Finish up your doing your garden. I wouldn't recommend going to the dentist today. Energy is the key now. It makes sense to focus on the tasks that do not require much attention and resources. Long term uh, projects are better left for later. Financial operations are bound to be successful. Favorable time for education. So your energy is the key. 
for right now, for today, um, Libra, or for the next couple of days, whatever, where, where, whenever you click on this reading, that's when your energy is going to start clicking in. Mm, excuse me. I'm going to double cleanse the energy, even though I already did. So yeah, photograph. Got a little wet. It's waterproof though. <laughs> okay. Um, another card we have is sunglasses. So yeah, somebody is really looking at your photo. So this is confirmation. This is confirmation that you could be looking at somebody's photos, watching somebody, stalking somebody, or somebody could be doing this to you. You could have Libra high aspect in your chart. Or you can just, um, this could be your zodiac, sun, moon, Venus, however it resonates. Top of the deck, we got lightning in reverse. So, uh, shocking news will be delayed for right now. Because it is going to be, it's like the energy is more, like on my perspective, the energy is more in um, Mercury retrograde. But Mercury retrograde don't start until May the 10th. But I'm already feeling Mercury retrograde. So, you know, it's just going to be sudden change and shocking news will be in reverse for right now. You might have to um, cleanse your energy like I just did and just watch your surroundings. Because I, I see like a stalking person too. So if you do like OnlyFans and stuff like that. Be mindful of the fans and people could be obsessed with you too is what I'm getting. If you do OnlyFans, don't be linking up with people right now. That's that's on the internet. Until until June, probably the, the ending of June, I'll probably link up with them. So if you haven't if you just now meeting people, I will be like cautious and, and take precautions. Like take take baby steps before you do anything like that. Okay, we got the number nine. These could be jersey numbers, your favorite numbers. Could be people that you know. Uh Capricorn. You could know a Capricorn, you could be dealing with a Capricorn. We got this. I'm kind of low-key matches my shirt. Somebody could be dealing with a Capricorn is what I'm getting. Or somebody could be obsessed with you, Libra. We got two, four, three. Somebody could be obsessed with you. It could be somebody you're in a relationship with or somebody that you're talking to. We got 30. We got four. That's why they're looking at your photos. That's what I'm getting. They saying that somebody that you... Oh, there you go. Unconditional love. Seduction. You're going to be having some girl talk pretty soon. There's going to be some palm tree stability, security. So what I'm seeing here is that you can have a love offer. Unconditional love, self-love. You can have self-love for yourself. You could be attractive. But yeah, somebody could be flirting with you, wanting to go on a date with you. You could be going on a date with someone. And you're going to have a girl talk, too. Happily single. Okay. So you could be moving away from somebody. You could have uh, left someone in the past. You could be single now. And then somebody's stalking you, so... This could be somebody from the past. They could be a crush, somebody that you talked to before. Somebody that you was in communication with is watching you. Somebody that you had, you could have sexual encounters with this person too, like a sexual connection. And you could be talking to your girls about it. It was like a girl talk. Y'all went places, palm trees. I'm hearing that song. Um, by Jeremiah and that dude, uh, TMB, TMG Fresh, and Jeremiah. It's a palm, it's like, it's um, top down. There we go. I'm hearing that song. I don't want to get copyrighted, so I'm not going to sing it. <laughs> I'm not having a good singer. So, yeah, there was an ending here. 
this person could have an addiction or was addicted to you. Like that's all that's all I was saying. Like somebody somebody could have been obsessed with you, looking at your photos, thinking of you too much, talking to you too much. And the, the clock was ticking. This person you probably needed some space and time alone, time to heal. This person probably was like always like coming towards you and always asking, you know, this and that and oh, can we go somewhere and stuff like that. But yeah, I see the camera here. So yeah, reminiscing. So you could be reminiscing or this person could be reminiscing. But I hear some obsession too. But I feel more of you could be. I mean, this person, the person that you dealt with could be going through this. So six. Six again. So six can resonate. We got ten. And we got four. Okay, let's go through some names. These could be this could be nicknames, random stuff that you could eat, some some stuff that you already ate. Some stuff that sounds similar to what you ate. These could be initials in your name. Um these could be your initials. These could be letters in your name. I said initials in your name. This could be letters that's in your name. So we have Starlet 43. Four, four plus three is seven, so seven can resonate. We got bi, somebody could be bisexual that's watching. Uh, we got October, so yeah, Libra, we showing up October. I'm hearing that Scorpio song by uh, by uh, what's his name? Money Bag Yo, I'm hearing that Scorpio song. So you could deal with a Scorpio, you probably got Scorpio highly aspect in your chart. Um, but yeah, go listen, go listen to Money Back Yo Scorpio. That might resonate. We have a hundred, so somebody could owe you a hundred dollars, something like that. We got Julian. We have Marvin Gay. Marvin Gay or Gay? I don't know if that's how you spell it either, because I was just writing names. Like names that came to my head in a certain way. I just wrote it down. Andrea. Ella. Velveeta. You could be eating Velveeta. This could be your name. We got 34. I don't know why I said it like that. 34. Uh, we got 50 Cent. Could be a favorite rapper, Lila, Layla, R O. Ellie, somebody you could have a baby with someone. You could be somebody, baby, mama, baby, daddy. We got L. Levi. I ain't even flip no cards out yet, and I'm already, you know, talking my butt off. Jackson, 49. That's how you know how highly connected I am. Marissa, 40. Now this song in my head, I'm going to just go ahead and say it was um, uh, 50 Cent, uh, Baby By Me. That's why I broke up Baby Mama, Baby Daddy. So somebody that you dealt with or somebody that's with you could be looking at your pictures. I feel like somebody from the past could be reminiscing, trying to come back into your life. You could be talking to this person, hear your talkies. Or this person trying to come in and communicate with you. But we going to do the cards and this going to come out. But that's what I'm going to say before I do the cards. Cameron. That's cute. That's a cute name, how they spelled it. On the thing. Monroe. Or how I spelled it, I don't know. So I did get some of these names from uh, uh, Google. Delilah or Delilah. Yeah, Delilah. You could be very talkative today. You got Skylar. 
I think I wrote Skyler twice. Twice. So I, I did have a different way. You got a thousand, so you could get. You could have a thousand supporters. Thousand. So, excuse me. Thousand supporters. Thousand subscribers. Or however resonate. You probably want to get to this level. You're probably not there yet, but you're gonna get there. Aurora. Aurora. We got the game. So that's the rapper, the game. I mean, that song uh, that he made with Kanye. That easy song that could resonate. We got Finley. We got Sophia. We got OV. 82. 96. Daphne. Jameson. AE. LG. Large. So they could be large to you. Very large is what I'm hearing. OM. H8. CI. CIA can resonate. We got UA. CN, CNA, or CNN can resonate. We got G8. J8, sorry. So G8. Uh, G8 can resonate. It could be dorm rooms, uh, places that you live, so apartments, you know, stuff like that. E8. I mean, EL. EJ. UQ. OI. PJ. Anonymously, or I don't know, I don't know how to pronounce that. Anonymously. For precise. That could that could just be a word. I think that is a name, but I, I think it's more of a word here. Precise. So you could be very precise with your with your language, with your um, speaking. So you could be into politicians, is what I'm hearing. You could be into economics or like politician stuff, like the elections and presidential stuff. Elizabeth. Andre. Audrey or OJ. If you want your name in here, um, you could comment your name down below. And I'll be glad to put your name in here if you like it. Phoenix, so it could pop out. And then you could get confirmation. You got Kai. Hey. You got Chandler. AB. Abigail Caresini, Abigail. Oh, we got Leo. Ooh. You could be dealing with a Leo. Sawyer. You could have dealt with a Leo. J4. That's that's probably the Leo. This is probably the person that, that looking at your pictures and stuff. We got TU. Or a Leo. You could be looking at a Leo pictures is what I'm getting. H. X L L So it could go both ways. It could be reversed. So you could be look Leo I mean Libra. You could be looking at Leo pictures or Leo could be looking at your pictures. But I feel like more of somebody yeah. So however resonate. So I'm gonna keep that right there. Let's get some general so let's see who is doing what. Let's uh, get some cards on the uh, photograph. So I see photograph. Oh, I forgot to clean my table today, so sorry it kind of looks like that. That's my little sister on my table. What's photograph for Libra today? What's photograph for Lib for Libras for the Libra today? Oh, it's another one. I N. 
Somebody could be going in on something. Somebody could be a uh, nosy investigator. I didn't see that one. It was on my thing. Okay, here we go. The Leo. So, yeah, we got King of Wands came out. So, yeah, somebody want to communicate with you. But you could be working on yourself. You could be independent here. So, yeah, that, that's the Leo. This is a Leo. Oh, I'm snitching on somebody. You could be a female that has King of Wands. You could be, like, bi or something. So, like, put it as your story. So, you could be a Leo, but you could be a feminine. But you pop it up as a King of Wands. So, because you could have more masculine in your chart. But yeah, I see a Leo here, Libra, that you dealt with. A Leo. Your birthday could be in October. You could also listen to Money Bag Yo, because I keep hearing that. Every time I say October, I hear that Scorpio song. So this person, what I'm getting from the cards that, that came out is that this person wants to communicate or y'all probably could be already communicating. And you could be just saying you want to work on yourself or you just independent. You don't really need nobody. Um, I'm hearing that T-Pay. Why are I keep getting a lot of songs today? You could be listening to a lot of music. But I'm getting that T-Pay song. Uh, I like that. So go listen to that song. If you already know that song, then that's how you is. You don't need nobody for nothing. You independent. Let's see what the eight of wands is. Yeah, you could be getting new love too with the ace of cups. This could be the new love here. What's the eight of wands? It could be a burden. The new love could be a burden. But let's 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 get some information on the eight of wands. What's the eight of wands for Libra? Okay, somebody could be walking away, or you could have walked away from this person already. So eight eight, this person needs to get balanced. Yeah, this person could be having judgment. This person could also be a burden to you, Libra. You probably could take. You probably have to take care of this person all the time. Like this person needs you. As I'm saying that that song. It's 11-11. Um, that song by uh, T-Pain. So you could be independent. This person needs you in their life. But there's judgment here. You could be walking away and then this person won't get judgment. It's going to be a karma, a karma justice here. You're going to get justice in the situation. Mm. Oh. Yup. He popped out everywhere. This person could have a temper. King of the Pentacles in reverse. This person probably really needy and greedy here. Because he fell out in reverse. Like, you see what I was going through? <laughs> this person could be upset because you leaving them. Their money could be, um, yeah, like I said, this person could need you. They don't have no money. They could be greedy, needy. Yep, tower. Oh, wow, these are a lot of cards. This person could be dealing with a, a Queen of Wands here. Aquarius. Or this could be around them. But yeah, there's a Tower moment for this person. Somebody could, somebody could um, have a baby daddy that's coming towards you. King of Cups or baby mama. But there's a Queen of Wands here. And uh, I see Aquarius, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Aries, Leo, Sag, and the King of Pentacles, so Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. So you could be dealing with any of these people. Could be a best friend is what I'm hearing, best friend. You call somebody your best friend. Somebody going to get judgment for doing uh, manipulation. Because they, they, somebody could have slept with you. Like, y'all could have slept with you. Like, a sexual connection. But I'm not getting on neither one. So this could have been like a regular relationship. You could have dealt with Aquarius or Air sign. Or you could be this star. You could be the star of the... the uh, 
You could be very attractive. Somebody wants to come in emotionally. This could be a new love offer here too. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Or you could be talking to this person. You could also have a baby daddy. Baby mama. But um, if you do, this person finds you very attractive. If you do have a, a baby daddy, baby mama, you still talking to them. Y'all still in a relationship. This person finds you very attractive. Um, if they haven't told you yet. This person is very shy too. Or he could be shy. But around other people, around other people, he, he's like this. He comes determined, you know, doing his thing. But it's going to be a tower moment with somebody in the past you could have possibly dealt with. It could have been a Capricorn because I did get Capricorn. So, somebody had that's in reverse, but the Capricorn card ain't came out. But you could be meditating too. You could be just working on yourself here. That's all I'm getting for you, Libra. It's just the people around you. I would I would stay away from a if you know a Taurus Virgo Capricorn. I would stay away from them because this person's angry and this person can have a temper. And I see two love offers, or this could just be your ex, and this could be a new love offer. Because King of Pentacles came out reverse. This person, this King of Wands could come up as a financial, like, this person could be in bankruptcy or just have no money. They could have a record, is what I'm getting, is a fire sign. But yeah, I just see you glowing, you doing your own thing, you traveling, you going places with the Three of Wands here. So people could, could be coming towards you too. People could be coming towards you. You could be looking at something. You could be doing magic on someone, like, you know, doing good magic, manifesting. You could be manifesting what you want, what you desire. People don't like it either, too, because you're walking away. There's a there's a fight, an earth sign or somebody that got earth and highly aspected in their chart that, that you're walking away from, and they don't like it that you're walking away. Or this person, this fire sign, it could be this fire sign too that need money. It could be a Leo. However it resonates, but yeah, Libra, that's all I'm getting for you. Just be mindful of the past coming back. Because somebody is, somebody is looking at your social media, looking at your photos. And somebody wants to communicate. But you're going to walk away. You're, you don't want it. It is going to be Mercury Retrograde, so I wouldn't recommend talking to anybody from the past right now. Okay? All right, Libra, it was good doing your reading. See y'all next one.